Um, so I found this basket yesterday at Value Village. Um, I don't go there a lot at all, um, but if I ever pass by one and I'm by myself and know I can spend some time, uh, I would pop in and see what I could find. So I found this basket and um, when I found it, actually, it didn't have, it was all one color. Um, when I got home, I painted it white down here. Um, I don't know if you've seen, but on uh, Pinterest and all these home decor blogs, like a lot of people are like um, paint dipping the bottom of their furniture, like chair legs and table legs and even baskets. A lot are getting colors on the bottom half or bottom quarter. Um, so I decided to give it a try. And here I... It, this this took me like literally 10 minutes yesterday and I put some flowers in it, put it on the coffee table and it looks great but um, you know having stared at it all evening I I think I could go a little higher with the white paint so that's what I'm going to do today because from if you're standing up you can't really see the white like let's just say that was the angle you were looking down at the basket at, um, you can't really see the white at all. So I'm going to bring it up higher. It's really simple. Um, what I have is just white acrylic paint from the dollar store. Um, I'm going to, that's my little glob. Um, but you're going to need more than that, but that's what I squeeze um, at a time. Uh, a sponge foam brush. And I just eyeball the line, like I don't even draw a line or tape off a straight line. Um, and I just paint. So I kind of think that I'm going to go about halfway on the basket instead of, like I did, I'd say I did a quarter yesterday. So I'm going to do half instead just to bring the line up. So I'm going to go about there. And I'm not too particular about being neat on this except that you know, I'd like it to kind of look like a straight line, so I just kind of find that that wicker that lets me follow it along. And then, but other than that, I'm not crazy about like getting into every nook and cranny to make sure I get paint in there because from far you don't really notice it anyway like I'm not gonna like look up close and and um, to see if I covered it all I know some people just uh, might go with spray paint which would have fuller coverage but I don't have spray paint or I do but I didn't feel like going outside to um, do this so if you can see I've like brought it up I will go over it and usually maybe about two coats, not really a coat, it's not like I wait for it to dry before I go over it again, but like I'll run over an area maybe at least twice. And the, um, it's that simple. So I could have gone with a color, but um, which which would be just as cute, I think like a turquoise, a yellow, or a pink would be really cute. Um, but I mean this is my first uh, dipped paint craft so I thought I would go a little safe just to see how I like it um, I, I do really like the white so you can't really go wrong with white or black or gray with anything but uh, maybe my next project if I decide to do something like this again I will go a color um, so that's about half done I'm gonna go the rest away around but if I sit on the table at least you know you see a bit more white now which I think is really cute so this the rest of this will take another like couple of minutes and then uh, and then we'll be done and that was about I don't know literally five minutes later and I am done see I you can tell I'm not too picky about getting a super straight line I know I could have been more accurate with my straight line but it doesn't really matter too much to me um, because you know, it's it's a crafty thing, like a hand it's supposed to look hand done, so 
I'm really, really not that picky. I could, I mean, if it bothers me later, I could go back and straighten out the line, but that is it, and uh, literally maybe a five minute makeover. Um, it's not a perfect basket either, as you can see, its shape is a little warped. You push it back. Um, but I kind of like the charm of that, so that um, for now will go on my coffee table and I don't have any fresh flowers on me but I think it'll look really cute with some fresh um, tulips or roses but I have some fake flowers with me right now so I'm just going to put those in and no, that doesn't look good and that is it a paint dipped basket.